Thanks for joining us, viewers, on today's edition of the Crypto Buzz via Calpine TV. I'm your host, Sage, and in today's show, we'll take a look over how the new US infrastructure bill will be affecting crypto traders, as well as take a peek at what our fave coins and meme coin prices are doing, and lastly, discuss Bitcoin robots and how they may be changing the way cryptocurrency is traded. So please stay tuned to the end. But before we begin today's show, let's just clear up one thing. Yes, your crypto holdings and Bitcoin are taxable in Australia and the USA. Virtual assets are considered property for tax purposes and taxed in the same way as the other assets you own, like stocks or gold. However, in the USA, authorities have had a busy weekend deciding how else they can tax cryptocurrencies in order to fulfill the US Senate's infrastructure package, costing $1 trillion. The case for taxing DeFi further is gaining momentum in the USA and could mean some drastic ramifications for the cryptocurrency space. Taxing Bitcoin transactions has come under the watchful eye of the US government as the Senate mills over ways to fund its $1 trillion infrastructure package. It's been estimated that taxing the high net worth individuals earning over $400,000 per year and the taxing of Bitcoin transactions could raise around $28 billion in funding. This means that things could get complicated for even swapping tokens. For example, record keeping when swapping Ethereum for other DeFi tokens will need to be recorded and itemized for the government in order to tax them like any other securities. While this bill is important, as it is needed for the rebuilding of America's roadways, bridges and other infrastructure that may be starting to get old and decrepit, it also raises a fundamental question about virtual currencies as an asset class. Crypto enthusiasts are not happy with this bill. Billionaire CEO Elon Musk responding to a tweet from Coinbase's CEO Brian Armstrong that he believes the new bill is disastrous. The Senate didn't have time to complete their definitions of brokers, exchanges, miners and cryptocurrencies in full over the weekend and the vagueness of the government's understanding of terms that are associated with Bitcoin ever since it emerged in 2009 has been an important issue. Regulators have finally established that accurate and concise definitions are a must, yet there are still delays on pinpointing precisely whether cryptocurrency is a commodity, security, an asset, or something entirely different. Various senators are taking into account an array of various tax issues, but are also conducting further investigation into whether proof of stake or proof of work cryptocurrencies will be protected from these new taxes. Elon Musk, however, is not alone on his stance about the new taxes, with other tech investors and crypto lobbyists also labeling the proposed changes disastrous and ridiculous. After the break, we'll investigate into the price of the cryptocurrencies which have been in the green for the last couple of sessions amid the heat about regulations. And now we wait to see what the US regulators will decide in regard to the weighing down of digital assets. However, what the world will have to come to terms with is how digital assets can evolve over time. And we'll be right back after this. Tune in to stay updated while on the move. We will tell you where the crypto craze has reached. Where the property market is headed next. What the world is doing to become more environmentally friendly. Apart from tracking the daily market charter. Be on top of the latest news and announcements with Calkine TV. Sage and get ready to take the crypto ride with me on Kalkine TV. Watch the crypto buzz every Tuesday and join the excitement at Kalkine TV from Bitcoins to NFTs to Dogecoin and DeFi. We have updates about everything around these digital currencies. Understand the investing rationale and the risks involved in the space with me, Sage, on Crypto Buzz. Keep watching Kalkine TV. Thanks for joining us, viewers. I'm Sage. You're watching the Crypto Buzz by Calkine TV. 
It seems the cryptocurrencies have been in a sea of green despite the political tensions from regulations being voted upon in Washington. The senators agree that $28 billion of funds raised from taxing crypto transactions will benefit the nation. They just can't decide on the exact words in order to sign to make it happen. And apart from an approximate 10% surge over the last week in Bitcoin, breaching even the US $45,000 mark, Will it cross the $50,000 mark is in the coming trading sessions? Or will it continue in its sideways movement? Is the red hot question on everyone's lips? We'll have to wait and see. Also, enjoying the green interlude is the second largest crypto by market capitalization Ethereum. Last week saw the fourth Ethereum community conference from Paris, where Ethereum's co-founder Vitalik Buterin spoke at the 2021 Ethereum community conference, which took place as an actual physical event. And the event attracted hundreds of speakers, multiple side events, meetups, panels and parties throughout Paris. Ethereum climbed over the $3,000 mark, surging 22%, and today remains above the US $3,000 level. Ethereum's rise in the community's conference coincide with the launch of EIP-1559 on August 5th. This will lead to the transition from Ether being proof of work to proof of stake instead. The update makes transaction fees transparent by burning Ether, where previously it was being paid out to miners. Let's move on now to the meme coins. And before you think you're seeing double, there is a spin-off to Dogecoin. And don't let it confuse you. No, I'm not talking about baby Doge. Shiba Inu, created last year, joined the meme coin surge in the last five days. It rose 16% in just one day over the weekend and 28% over the past week. It's difficult to track what actually delivers price rises for the cryptocurrency market. But word has it that Coinbase has not yet listed the new meme stock, Shiba Inu which means is it has to be stored in cold storage offline wallets. Crypto enthusiasts will be keeping a keen eye on when Coinbase does decide to list Shiba Inu coin as it may instigate price movement for the new meme coin, saying that the move was expected to be implemented by Coinbase Pro in June 2021. In other meme stock news, Baby Doge has reached 540,000 holders and is getting ready to unveil the Tesla that will be decked out in Baby Doge decal wrap for a mega giveaway to one lucky community member. Check out Baby Doge's Twitter page for more information. And Dogecoin is down 64% from its all-time high, reaching 73 cents US on the 8th of May. The popular meme stock has seen its price surge 22% in the last seven days and over the weekend also saw 14% increase. It's now time for another break, but after the break, we'll investigate into how quantum computing is affecting the cryptocurrency sector. Stay tuned to Calkine TV. Tune in to stay updated while on the move. We will tell you where the crypto craze has reached. Where the property market is headed next. What the world is doing to become more environmentally friendly. Apart from tracking the daily market charter. Be on top of the latest news and announcements with Calkine TV. Welcome back viewers, it's Sage here, you're watching the Crypto Buzz and in our last segment we'll take a closer look at Quantum AI and what this UK based company is doing for crypto investors. If an internet currency emerging into the mainstream is not enough to make you realise we are waist deep in the technological society and we have well and truly passed the point of no return, it's no secret that quantum algorithms in artificial intelligence techniques We'll see a boost in years to come surrounding the capabilities of machines learning. What we are expecting to see is improvements related to developments of prediction systems and cryptography as well. It may come as a surprise that machine learning and AI are being utilised in the financial industry, giving rise to quantum machine learning. And here, researchers have experimented with ways to expedite existing processes, applying quantum computing algorithms to artificial intelligence techniques. Within the banking sector, an improvement in the fight against fraudulent activity has been a major benefit, and the speed in which the quantum computing processes are able to manage swathes of big data is advantageous due to the accelerated pace at which the algorithms can be applied to mass volumes of data. 
AI is also being deployed in the use for developing economic policy and managing the big data associated with the recent Brexit policy changes for the UK and the European Union. UK-based crypto trading platform to some sounds almost too good to be true with a low minimum initial deposit and free account registration. Quantum AI. In recent times, the emergence of Bitcoin robots have caught the attention of some investors. Let's take a closer look at one platform today called Quantum AI. So Quantum AI is designed to give users an easy to use automated trading platform operating in the three continents of North America, Asia and Europe. The computing strength's ability to scan through a large volume of trades is showing some promising results with the number of people becoming wealthy from their investments. Having experience in developing software solutions for the banking industry since 2003, Quantum AI have a network of registered and reputable brokers that are regulated by the government. This gives assurance that Quantum AI is doing what they can to partner with the best in the business. With an initial minimum investment being around only $350 Australian in order to compute and analyse massive streams of information allows for faster decision making from the app user. This type of technology first was used for, by former Lehman Brothers staff who constructed the Kraken, which was a quantum artificial intelligence tool available to the investment bankers' clients who paid a minimum of $5,000 per month in licensing fees. However, the technology was sold when the Lehman Brothers crashed, morphing into Quantum AI. Now under a new guise, ready to continue to provide a solution to the global poverty issue. Supported by customer service infrastructure that is 24-7 tutorial videos and up-to-date security technology that is essential for the safety of trading in cryptocurrency, these automated and austere solutions are pushing Quantum AI into the position of market leader through the use of its self-learning trading app most notably allowing large earnings in a short period of time. With the help of quantum computing and AI, the once unconceivable prospect of accessing hundreds of accurate cryptocurrency trading decisions made in a flash of time, something that with the use of only our little brains would take little short of a lifetime. Quantum AI is proving that the retail investors can only gain from the level playing field of a more democratised currency exchange market leading to the development of a more stable and wealthy economy where people are given the tools and with the right amount of training and dedication can hopefully enable the financial security necessary for a full and stress-free life. The cryptocurrency market is volatile, however, and caution should be taken when approaching your investment decisions related to the sector, starting with small investments until you have dedicated enough time to learning how the quantum AI system operates should be considered when managing your risk to reward ratio based on your financial objectives and current situation. And hopefully you've enjoyed today's edition of the Crypto Buzz and that you've been able to take something away with you. Please stay tuned, however, for more trending stock market and business news, updates on the diverse sectors of the economy. This is Sage signing off.